Luke and Most Prime here reacting to Scary Creep and Villain Rises Part 10 by Mr. Yons and Dendan Sarsoff of I'm on full screen and let's go! Joker. Yes! Jim Cummings is like the best voice of Ghost in uh, any form of media really. Although the actor who played it in Our Man of the Lost is really good, he's the best voice, definitely. Oh, yes. Bronco Jackson's like the uh, best voice of a uh, mind wipe in any Transformers media, really. That voice is so intimidating and scary. It's what you need. That voice is pretty creepy. Oh, right, Creeping me out. I don't know what spell you went and cast on me, but I wanted to stop right now. I didn't cast a spell on you or anyone else. I only did what you wanted. Why would I want you to torment me with nightmares? You didn't want to catch bugs and I helped. You didn't want to lose friends and I helped. If there's a problem with you, It was meant to be used to help people. So why is it Never seen this to before. kill them instead? Because that's the job we state alchemists have been given to do. You ask why we're here killing these people instead of protecting them? Because this Not is a bad. war and that's what soldiers do. Isn't that right? You think this is our job? To cause tragedy? Well, that's how it seems. But let's see. Tell me, miss. You're not very happy to be here, are you? Well, you don't appear to be. But can you honestly tell me, in that split second when you take down an enemy, you don't allow yourself to feel the slightest tinge of satisfaction and pride in your skills? Well, Miss Marksman... That's enough, Kimberly! I'll tell you what I don't get. Did you people expect something different? You act like you're surprised, like you didn't choose this. Did you put on that uniform thinking you wouldn't be asked to kill? The one thing worse than death is to avert your eyes from it. Look straight at the people you kill. Don't take your eyes off them for a second. And don't ever forget them. Because I promise that they won't forget you. I have a 
Kai Burn. Yes, heck yes. Kai Burn is like the best place of Brainiac in any uh, media whatsoever in DC. The voice is so calculating and evil, it's perfect for a character. Only he can be Brainiac. And of course, he came out as a character in DC Universe Online too. Yeah, he's voice in the animated universe of DC. Uh, that includes, you know, uh, Static Shock as well, and also um, Legion of Superheroes, and of course, Youth Universe Online. And he also came back as an like, well, DC supervillains too. Oh, yes. I saw this when I was a kid. It was a good movie. He was good as a uh, pitch. Very evil character. So good. Can I see him in Captain Marvel, Jude Law? He was also good as a young Albus Dumbledore too in the new Fantastic Beast film as well. Great actor, Jude Law. Just a That's such a good dream. voice for oh, evil character. That's like a goblin hope, isn't it? Yeah. Definitely. What's the plan, Osborne? And your hair won't magically come into fashion. Never seen me before. Things like a comic book thing, isn't it? That voice is pretty good for her. Monstrous, you know, Goblin Hulk. Love it. Shut up! Jesus. That's good, that. Never seen myth before, but this voice is really good so far. Yes, I like that. That is good. Pretty creepy. Sounds like smog, doesn't it? It's good, that. Wow, I like that voice. Yes, heck yes. David Sobolov is the best voice of Gorilla Grodd ever. 
that voice is it's so monstrous and scary. The best voice of God ever is David Sobolov. And he also came back as a character in like with his super villains too, which was really cool. Oh, Bill Nighy in Rango. Hmm. Never seen Rango before, but I like Bill Nighy. He's a great actor, so yeah, thumbs up. Alan Tudyk. Oh yeah, it's a uh, si Simon. You think to Simon P? Yes, absolutely. I love Alan Tudyk better as Green Arrow in that same shot and, and both in Justice games, and also as K2SO from Rogue One. But wow, he's pretty good as a uh, Simon here. I think it's a Simon P. I think. Usually it is. If that's not the case, then let me know in the comments. Well, actually, I did, but you needn't have bothered. It's being recorded for posterity. No! Uh, uh, uh. I didn't say Simon says. <laughs> I think it is Simon, yeah. Willem Dafoe. I have bad news to report. What is it? Yes, heck yes. Willem Dafoe is such a great actor. He'll always be the Green Goblin to me, and he, he's also really good as vocal in Aquaman. So good. But he he's really good here. I like this voice. Very good. In the next one, Patrick, can you please add him as a Green Goblin? Please. Oh, yeah, and can you add Tom Hardy as Venom as well, please? That's who I'd like to see in the next one. Yeah, Willem is pretty much a villain actor, really. There's only a few horses play which are good, really. You know, as good characters, like Volkov, for example. Find him for me here, or else I will fail, my lord. I've waited a long time for this sparrow hawk. Oh, special one. You did much better than I expected. I'm still sensing some hesitation, but I think you've made some real progress. Yes, yeah, that's also really good. I like it. Friend, you can stop fighting me now. How come you've made him a special one, Patrick? Please let me know in the comments why you See? picked him a special. As long as you keep pleasing me like this, you'll be perfectly safe, Papyrus. Boy, you got a little banged up, huh? Take care of that for you. How better? I fixed your clothes too. Now, I know you train with Undyne, and you practice three hours a day like a good boy. That voice. I'd like us to keep having this so scary. It's like one that could give you nightmares, isn't it? Just to give you the edge you need. Sound good? You want to be in the Royal Guard, don't you? I of course you do. Not running away. Even staying quiet? We are making progress. I don't want you to be afraid of me, Papyrus. Seeing you succeed and get what you want would make me happy. Because I'm your friend. Isn't that right? Yes. Wow, that was so good. Nice one, Patrick. Very well done. 
So, okay, so it's me reacting to Scary Creepy and Villain Voices Part 10. So, give this video a like. Let me know in the comments who you found scary and creepy. Subscribe to my channel, and I will see you all later.